Welcome to you all to the KCOM Stadium. Alan Smith is with me and I'm Martin Tyler. And the match today, Hull City against Arsenal. And your Hull City. Hull City line. Number 16, Elvin Yakubovic. Number 27, Ahmed El Rahamadi. Number 13, Andrea Ramachia. Number 5, Harry Maguire. Number 3. How has it been for Hull City? Well, I can tell you it's been very poor defensively. We'll be hoping, they'll be hoping too, that they can tighten it up today. No, I think the fans at times have been looking through the fingers, fearing the worst watching this team because they have conceded so many. We've got the Hull City team here for you. Camille Grosicki starts with Lazar Markovic on the flanks. And just one out and out attacker in the lineup. This is the Arsenal lineup. Perecek starts in goal. Hector Bellerin plays with Monreal in the fullback positions. Alexis Sanchez starts with Alex Oxlade Chamberlain looking to provide width. And we'll see how the striking option works with just one up front. Thank you. It's Arsenal to kick off. Mesut Ozil. Nacho Monreal. Santi Cazola. Here's Bayerin. Ramsey. Danny Welbeck. Here's a chance to attack. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they still got the ball. The uh, attack has fizzled out here. Goal kick. Nokia. Doing well to keep the ball. Attacking now. Well, he tried to find his man, but he's only put the ball into touch. Santi Cazola. Oh, he showed great anticipation there. Makes a challenge here. He's gone in very fairly and won the ball cleanly. Aaron Ramsey. Meza Ozil moving forward with menace. Well, that looked promising, but he's been stopped. And Dyer. Then comes the challenge. Meza Ozil. Hull City have the ball back. And that will clear the danger. Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain. Hector Berry. Berry. Shot on! Deflected behind. A clear corner. Back. Well, he was lurking dangerously at the corner, wasn't he? And the ball broke for him. Yeah, I think that may have been a, a training ground routine that worked pretty well until the shot. Cut out the pass. Comes in strongly. It's Mesut Ozil now in a dangerous area. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. And the goalkeeper will get this one, no problem. Quick header, found the teammate. That's the way to win the ball back. And Dyer. On to 
on to the attack now. Shots on here. And the goalkeeper with a textbook save and keeps the ball in his grasp. And now the shot. Very good stop here. It's a corner for Hull. Could be dangerous. The shot's on. Good work by the goalkeeper. Well read by the defender. Oh, and Dyer. Good goal to take the lead here. And that has opened the scoring. 1 0 here. Well, this attack has got a bit of menace to it. Danny Welbeck just working away to try and find an opening. Not what we expected to see, I must say, from Arsenal. Not what they expected to... He's got his shot off now. That's a gift for them. It's an own goal. Well, it can happen to anybody that he's being consoled by his teammates, but uh, he looks devastated. It is uh, level. Both sides have scored here now. Good challenge. Here's a chance to attack. Welbeck! He's a great team player, Danny Welbeck, but he gets his share of goals for himself as well. And this is in typical Danny Welbeck fashion. He didn't need any power, really, just enough to roll it past the goalkeeper because the placement was so good. I think you've got to be playing with an awful lot of confidence to try that, and he is. Mesut Ozil. Good position, they've worked this attack very well. The break is definitely on. Oxley chamberlain well, he scored, and it's a big moment for them in the match. They've pushed their lead now to two ahead. They've played well to this point, but sometimes a two-goal lead can be a dangerous one. We'll see. Just a reminder, 3-1 it is now, the scorer. Well, that's half-time, and 3-1. Three changes all at the same time. It's quite a drastic decision from the manager. So here we go for the second half. And Dyer. Real good contest between these two as they jostle for possession. Good forward play from them. Tries the through pass. And here's a chance for Arsenal. And here's the shot. And it's in. An Arsenal goal. Four one is the scoreline. Arsenal goal. Number eight. And Dyer. It's looking good this move. Well, they passed their way up into a good position here and then just lost the concentration, lost the ball as well. And they've got to work hard to try and get it back. Nicely played through ball. And it's a headed effort at goal. No, no, no! Well, the defenders could only watch and pray because they'd been left for dead, but he just couldn't finish it. Hull City making a change here. Mesut Ozil. He made that look like a poor pass with a very good interception. And Dyer. Well, he's threaded the pass through neatly. Defender to it first. Well, here could be a chance for the corner. 
We've reached the hour mark. Half an hour to go. Maloney, they scored! It's always great for the coach when the substitute scores, as has happened here. Well, heart in mouth time for the player that's hit it, but he's got his just rewards, it's a goal. Plenty of goals for the fans here, 4-2. Off we go again. Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain. Aaron Ramsey. Nacho Monreal. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they still got the ball. Taken quickly. Gabriel Palista. Possession given away once more. Hull City ready to make a substitution now. Mesut Ozil. Now, here is a chance for them. He's got his tackle in, and the ball's gone out now. Just a quick check on the clock, and there are 20 minutes to go. Sean Maloney. Gets his foot in there. Hull City, time ticking away for them. It looks like the opposition is in for an aerial bombardment here. Judging by the way, the centre-halves are going forward. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition, now they're here. And that's good support as they build this attack. Ramsey. This is how they love to play on the break. In with a chance. Oh, saved by the goalkeeper at full stretch. It's a corner for Arsenal here. Well, they've been uh, thwarted here. That's a sign of better things to come. It is very much the authentic Arsenal now, after, I guess, a few words were said at half-time. But the turnaround in the second period has been pretty spectacular. Markovic. Well, they're in a good position here. Looking to play his teammate through. They've coped with it well defensively. Well, the fans love this. The goalkeeper coming up to the opposing penalty area for the corner. Aaron Ramsey. Did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. Good, strong tackle. Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain. On the attack here. The referee certainly not uh, flagging in his application of the law. Free kick. The referee has indicated there will be a minimum of three minutes. Olivier attention. Giroud. Through pass. Sean Maloney. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. I don't think he was quite sure. And there it is, game over, and Arsenal are the winners. Well, they always say it doesn't matter who scores the goal, and I suppose that's even more applicable when it's an own goal. Yeah, you take what you can get, don't you? Because it will be on the shoe will be on the other foot at some stage, and uh, they'll be delighted with that. The home team have lost, and that Achilles heel, if you like, the worst defence, has been shown up again. They uh, will try and take the positives from it. I'm sure the manager will be talking those.